Amanda, don't tell me you're still going through your meal. Esther, it's been four days. Four good days. I haven't gotten any feedback from the company. Or am I assuming things? Amanda, all those companies, you know it's not all the time they get back to their applicants very early. Sometimes it takes about weeks. Esther, I'm not an applicant. I have been interviewed. I'm getting worried. I know, I understand. Don't worry, they'll call you, okay? I'm worried too, but we should keep up a positive mindset. Esther, you're the only one keeping me in check. Because to be honest, I'm losing my mind. Amanda, don't worry, okay? All right? Put a smile on your face. <laughs> it's fine. How about we do something interesting tonight? Okay. <laughs> Amanda got back so quickly. Hold on. Is this the residence of Amanda? Come in, come in. Yes, um, how may I help you? Okay, um, I'm from King's. She applied as a technical operator. So I'm here to give her appointment later. Wow, you mean Amanda is going to be working with you as your technical operator? You mean King's? Like the King's? Yes, that one. So um, where is she, please? I need her to sign as proof that she has received her letter. Um, okay, the thing is, Amanda is not around at the moment and she's going to be gone for a very long time. She actually traveled to Sacramento to see her mom. They have some family issues, so she won't be back in another weeks or months. Oh, um, that's too bad. We really needed her. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, if that's the case, I'll take my leave then. Um, hold on. Since uh, Amanda is not available, I'm sure you will need someone to, you know, fill up the position immediately, right? Yes, we need someone urgently. Uh, then I think I can do it. You can take the test. Of course, I can take any test. Okay, um, then you have to drop by the office on Monday for the test. If you pass, you get the job. <laughs> I promise you, I'll definitely pass. If that's the case, then I'll be on my way. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming. All right. Have a nice one. Oh, bye. Whoa. Her mother never told me it was kings. Hmm. Lucky. Good day. Good day. Who is Esther, please? Um, I. Alright. The all we can leave, I'll get back to you. Miss Esther. Yes, sir. Congratulations, you got the job. Really? Yes. Oh my god. Thank you so much, sir. You're welcome. Please grab your things and come with me. Alright, sir. Hi, Amanda. Welcome. Where did you go to? Thank you. I went job hunting. So how are you? I'm not fine. You won't believe this. The company hasn't gotten back to me since. Wait. That's true. It's been a week already. And the worst part is that they told me I was their best candidate for this job. I just wonder why they didn't pick me. I'm so pissed. Amanda, it's okay. All right? Uh, I mean, you know your what. You can just keep looking for other places. All right? You're so sweet. Thank you. You're welcome. Anyways, I got another job. Really? Yes. But the pay is lesser. How much? 7K per month. 
Oh, I see. That is why you wanted King job, right? Exactly. I mean, it's something. While working for this particular company, you can be looking for somewhere else where they can pay you more. Yeah. Yes, that reminds me. I have this um, technical brief that I want you to help me go through. I'm trying to sort it out. Esther. Hmm? Technical. You barely know basics. I know, but... I mean, I can work with anything for now. I just need something doing. Okay. It's fine. I will do it and I'll bring you to your room later. Thank you. That is why you are my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'll bring my room. Okay. And I'll see you later, okay? Concerning the contract, yes. I just hope that you. Hi. I know that lady. Is, is that not Esther? Esther. Yes. Uh, she's Amanda's friend. Yes. Yes. I've, I've met her before. What's she doing here? Um, she works here. I actually went to Amanda's house to deliver her appointment letter to her, but. I met her friend, Esther. She said um, Amanda traveled to Sacramento for, for I guess, family issues or something. Um, Esther offered to take the position, so she went for the test and she passed. So she works here. That's quite strange. I mean, Amanda didn't tell me anything about Sacramento or any family issues. You know what? Um, it's not yours to bother about. Um, just fill me in about the contract. Right? Okay. Yeah. Sure. So, wait. If I'm getting you correctly, are you telling me that Esther took the job that's supposed to belong to me? Is that what you're saying? Exactly. I mean, Justina told me about coming to your house and Esther saying something about you going to Sacramento to see your mom concerning some uh, family issues. Oh my God. My mom has been dead for over Amanda. five years. Amanda! I have another project for you. Oh. Oh, what? Why did you stop? Esther, so you're the one that took the job I've been complaining to you every single time about. And you kept on consoling me with your evil mouth. But yet, you were stabbing me at my back. Amanda. Look, you can get another job, but I can't. Does that give you the reason to take the job I worked so hard for? Okay, you know what? We can share the salary. Uh, this girl is mad. Can you imagine? <sighs> Esther, I want you to go inside and pack your things and leave my house. Immediately. Amanda, what do you mean by that? <laughs> you want to throw me out of your house just because of a mere job. I mean, a job you can get anywhere. You know what? I'll do you the honors. Okay? Don't, don't let this girl get in between our friendship. Friendship? Esther, you call this friendship? I kept on complaining to you, but you were stabbing me. Esther, you're very wicked. I'm sorry. Oh, please. Get out. You heard her clearly. Why are you doing this? <laughs> 